Hello everyone and welcome to a very, very special little video of the brand new just dropped trailer for the Elden Ring DLC, Shadow of the Erdtree. It has finally come. This is on the mark of the two year anniversary since Elden Ring actually released. I'm so excited. I've been waiting for ages. I've been talking about it in any of my game playthroughs. I'm just so chuffed it's here. I'm going to play the trailer and see what it's about and you'll get my reaction. I've not seen it yet, so this is a blind playthrough. So yeah, let's get going. I'm so excited. Peggy 16. Praise the sun. Praise the sun. Moog's palace. Pure and radiant. He wields love to shrive clean the hearts of men. <gasps> Could it be? Is this where we start? There is nothing more terrifying. Oh. Oh. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Uh been waiting for so long it feels oh so this must be pre i think this is pre what we've just been is going that through second place blood must spill blood of your fellows they are too faithful oh some new places they will never wow. think Answer the original. Inside of a wall. What the f? Oh my days! <laughs> oh! Oh my God! Look at that! Where is that? Is that somewhere new? Holy shit! Mother, what's that? Truly, Lordship Sanction in one so bereft of <gasps> oh. Melina? I presume you, too, are keen to know. Whoa! Just what kind? Oh, some new weapons. That look like a Radagon sort of roar. Wow. What the frick is that? <gasps> oh, my days. Of the race of gold, gold mask? Death. In the race of Mesmer's, Mesmer's flame. Come now. Holy crap. Touch the withered arm and travel to the realm of shadow. Oh, will not be far behind. May we meet again. What? What? So, okay. I'm just, I'm just trying to think. This is definitely before, and there's some amazing looking bosses there. But it kind of looks like a similar world, so maybe parts of the same world. Maybe we enter it via Moog's Palace. That's why you kind of start there. But there's so many questions going through my brain right now. I don't know if it's saying when it releases. Ah, oh, Mikula? Oh. 21st of June, 2024. Oh my God, I've got so long to wait. <laughs> But this does give me time to finish off my current playthrough, which is nearing the end. And maybe I'll do some uh, New Game Plus because I still need to kind of figure out my character style playthrough. Definitely, definitely, definitely going to be melee. But in this new DLC, it looks like you get some new incantations like that uh Raw, the lion raw kind of reminds me of Radigan, um, and some of the bow stuff I've not seen before either. So it could be that we just get a whole myriad of new weapons as well and armors and setups. So that's amazing. It would be cool if they incorporate the current Elden Ring world. 
Um, but maybe it's just before, obviously, the whole burning of the uh, tree that we are currently doing right now. Um, and some new characters like this mother... I mean, um, uh, I'm just blown away. I think this is going to be a hefty DLC. I think this is going to be a good 30, 40 plus hours of playthrough, maybe more. You can probably make it more. I'm hoping that it's going to have some little side quests, but if not, the bosses and everything look amazing. It looks like it's well thought through and well planned, which... To, to be honest, you're going to expect for Elden Ring, you're going to expect um, from software, like they have it dialed in when it comes to DLC. And this is such a massive game. Like, I've been playing this game for two years solid. So what does that tell you? And I'm not even from the sort of Souls community. I mean, I'd like to think that I am now because I've constantly played Souls games. But before Elden Ring, no, I could not play those games. I, I appreciated them, but I couldn't play them. Elden Ring gave me the courage to actually go forward. And now, like, I am fully in. I'm a Souls lover. I'm playing Dark Souls 1 Remastered currently. If you're interested in that, please have a look on my um, channel. And I'm playing Elden I'm literally finishing Elden Ring again now. And it's kind of a little bit different for me. I haven't been using Wiki or anything like that. So it's a, not really a blind playthrough, but unassisted maybe you could say so yeah please support the channel thank you so much i am so stoked i cannot wait i'm going to be taking time off in june and i'm going to whack out as much of this dlc i can for you as soon as possible give us a like subscribe if you're enjoying the content thank you so much for joining me take care and until next time ta-ta